हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम अगेन टू सिलेनियम विद सी शार्प ट्रेनिंग सो लास्ट टाइम वी हैव सीन हाउ टू इंस्टॉल विजुअल स्टूडियो व्हाट इज अ वेरिएबल व्हाट आर द डिफरेंट डेटा टाइप्स इन सी शार्प देन एरेज इन सी शार्प एंड स्ट्रिंग्स इन सी शार्प सो लेट्स कंटिन्यू विद द सेशन एंड वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द कंडीशंस देन द लूप्स एंड द फंक्शंस so let's start with the condition first so everybody is aware about the if else condition right so this is what we are going to discuss it all about so here it is a syntax and the statement is so if then and then the statement right so let's see that so the very important thing is the syntax so if you go with the if then the condition or the boolean expression if the condition is true only then and then only it will execute right so this is what the if statement is all about so let's go and do the practically if condition right so let me just dis declare one variable say integer of say number equals to minus 1 right so i declared a number which is in minus 1 so let me just give a num2 or num3 as a variable name okay say integer of number 3 is equal to minus 1 so we are going to check whether the number is positive or negative so if the num is okay so this num 3 which is say greater than okay if it is greater than 0 then it is positive correct so we can say that console dot console dot right line number is positive console dot right line number is positive okay number is positive so this is what only you know the if condition right so now if you say that the number 3 which is assign it's minus 1 so which is a negative right so this statement won't get executed right that the number is positive but if i go with say num1 num equals to 1 num3 equals to 1 then it is a positive right so let me just save and run it quickly so this is a positive case that the boolean value it returns true and then it will print that in the number is positive but if i go with the minus 1 and which is the negative right so yes number is positive now it is printing minus 1 sorry it's in the number is positive now let's try to understand this minus 1 if i give the minus 1 then then we have to go with the else statement okay if else statement so else and then we have to print number is negative number is negative okay so we can go with number is negative right so this is very simple okay so number is negative so you people can also try it out whether the number is given number is in the odd or even that also you can do it so now here it is number is negative so i gave i mentioned here it is a num 3 equals to you know it's minus 1 and that's why it is printed that is a number is negative right so this is all about the if and if else condition now there is a something called as nested if else right and you know the multiple if condition so for example now i have a three numbers and you have to find out the greatest among three numbers okay so how to find out the greatest among three numbers right how to find out the greatest among three numbers so we can go with the nested you know the, this is multiple if condition so if then else if so we have a multiple conditions right so we have to check whether the a is greater than b right and a is greater than c so a is greatest else if b is greater than a and b is greater than c then b is greatest and else in the c is greatest so this is the logic we have to apply it for this using if else if else conditions so that is a multiple conditions that we can go with okay so let's try to do this you know the multiple conditions okay so let me just declare you know the some variables as well as the values suppose for example it's a num 4 
is say 10 right then num 4 num 5 equals to 20 and num 6 equals to 30 right so I want to find out you know, the greatest among these three numbers okay so we have to go with the if condition so if right whether this num 4 is greater than right num 5 okay and we have to use num 4 is greater than num 6 correct then we have to say it's console dot right line <coughs> excuse me num 4 is greatest right else else if else if then I have to check whether num 5 which is greater than num 4 and logical operator and num 5 which is again greater than num 5 which is greater than num 6 okay so num 5 is greatest num5 is greatest and else you know else part that is num6 is greatest you don't need to check the condition yes so we have already checked for num4 and num5 so you don't need to check for num6 so console dot right line and then num6 is greatest okay so hope that everybody has understood this logic right so we are using a logical operator and and we are going to check you know the multiple conditions so let me just check it out so we are getting num6 is greatest so hope that everybody is clear about it right okay so thank you for watching and keep learning thank you